You can learn almost any skill online. You can learn underwater basket weaving on Pinterest or how to catch a snake on YouTube. On WikiHow, you can even learn how to insult someone. But do you really want to acquire any of these dubious skills? You can weave baskets on dry land, you're better off leaving your snakes alone, and you certainly don't need to learn how to insult someone. One of the best known teachings of the ethics of our father says, who gets covered? One who gives covered to others. Which means, who is honored? One who honors others. The people most worthy of honor are not the world leaders, the billionaires, or the great artists. Such famous people may receive plenty of attention and recognition, but their accomplishments don't necessarily entitle them to covet. True honor goes to those who honor others. With these few words, our sages taught us the trick to being honored, treating other people as if they're people worthy of your honor, speaking to them with covet. Imagine you walk into a loud party where everyone is gathered around the guest of honor. No one even notices your arrival. And then suddenly, in the midst of all the attention, the guest of honor interrupts what they're saying, turns to greet you with a big smile and a sincere welcome. You would feel thrilled to be recognized like that and receive such meaningful greeting. You would probably reciprocate that great honor right back with interest, treating that person who honored you with even more respect and honor than you received. And that's how it works. What earns the real honor is honoring others. And you don't have to be the guest of honor to do it. No one likes to walk into a room of people and nobody greets or even acknowledges you. It's an awful feeling. It's like you don't exist. Anyone in the room can change that and come over with a smile and a welcome. To earn the respect of others, we have to shower them with honor and respect, starting with a gracious greeting to everyone we meet. Try this today. When you greet someone today, make a point of being extra respectful and pleasant. Then, see how they respond. Do you receive more honor than you otherwise would have? I'm Aaron Baruch and I'm speaking to you with Colin.